America tour. And um, it's pretty early in the morning and I'm driving, so I don't know how good the sound quality is, but I want to just kind of come on here and just say, um, and kind of describe what Clog America is and like, and how it all works. So last September, or it was even longer than that, I think several years ago, one of my friends that was on my team, she, um, and one of the guys that was on my team actually, they both went on this Clog America tour to different countries in Europe. And I just thought that that was the coolest thing and I just really always wanted to do it. And then my uh, clogging teacher actually was like, you know, Savannah, I think that you would do really well at Clog America. I think you'd do really, and I was like, really? Are you sure? I don't know. I was like, I don't know if I'm good enough. And they said, no, I think you should just audition because I'm sure you, you would make it. So I like thought about it for a long time and I waited to see when um, auditions were. And then I signed up and I went to the audition and seriously I had no idea if I was gonna know anybody I had no idea who all was gonna be there or if I was gonna be the best one or if I was gonna be the worst one or what the whole deal was I just kind of showed up and i would never really been to an audition that I didn't know if I was gonna make it or not so I went to the audition and they taught a couple things, a couple dance moves, and then we performed in front of a couple judges, and then that was it, and they said, okay, we'll let you know in a couple weeks if you made it, and then we'll give you all the information, and sure enough, two weeks later, I got an email saying I made the team, and I was so excited, and so what it is, is every month, we meet together as a group, and kind of, um, rehearse and go over, whoa, that was a bird that just flew across the thing, kind of rehearse um, and learn all new dances, so it's only once a month, but it's from eight, usually nine is about the average time, some people have been starting at eight, just it depends on what dance you're in, um, so you, we usually start at nine and go till five, which is so long, like Vlogging all day is exhausting and by the end of the day we're just kind of like burned out, we're tired, we don't want to do it anymore and it's just like especially hard. So um, once a month we just get together, learn all the stuff and rehearse it even more and then um, we're kind of left to our own devices for the next month and then we come back and we rehearse again a month later and now this is my final rehearsal because the next rehearsal we have is June 2nd and that's a performance um and it's where we'll we'll have a dress rehearsal the time before and then we'll have a performance that night and then a week later we start tour um and then what we're gonna do is just we're gonna go to three different countries um I think I can say I don't know the rules are really weird but we're going to Sweden, Finland, and Denmark. I know I can't say when we're gonna be there um, just because like our tour team they're very protective of us and they want to make sure that nothing bad happens so I can't even post about places that I've been until after I've left the country. So we start we fly out and the flight is like seriously it's like 13 hours long which I'm not really excited for. And then I have to go completely off of social media for the entire month um, that I'm there. I can take pictures, but I can't post or anything um, until I'm back. And we'll be in each country for a period of anywhere between three and five days. And then we have any probably two to three performances, but they won't be till night. So I'll have an entire day to kind of just roam around the city. Um, yeah, and so that's kind of what's going to be happening over the next several months. It always seemed like it was so far away, but it's only a couple weeks now. I think we're about three weeks out, which is insane to me. It's so crazy. Um, anyway, so that's kind of what I'm up to, and now... I officially
actually stopped nannying, so I should be able to put out better videos than just put throwing one together and then putting it up. So, I will see you guys later. Bye. Whoop.